Maybe put a little food in your hand. You have to do it like Crocodile Dundee. Mmm. Got a massive booger. <laughs> All right, we're gonna use the loader tractor. I'm gonna get a bale of grass hay to coax the cows across the road and bring them home from about a mile and a half away. We need to add antifreeze in the tractor first. We buy our antifreeze pure in bulk, and then we can cut it 50-50 with water. We will grab, which grass bale do you want? This one on the end? Looks pretty good. Want a good bite on it? Because the cows are gonna try to take it away from me. This is my joystick that controls the loader. Forward is down, side is bucket roll, left side is roll back, and then the switches on top run the uh, grapple. Hopefully I can see over the top of it. There are the cows. It may have eaten a lot of that seed corn, turnips, radishes, and rye. They have eaten it down really pretty good. So after we bring them home and sort off the calves, we will run the cows to two other fields, another seed field and then a commercial corn field. So they'll be able to graze out there for another two months. Plenty of food out there. So I'm going to let the fence down right here and then pull into the field. And hopefully this bale of grass will start attracting them to me. And then Laura and the hired man should run the rest of them up to me. And then we'll draw them across the highway and hopefully the traffic on the highway understands they'll be calm and patient and let our cattle cross the road. has disconnected the power to the fencer so this fencer is not hot. Mmm, that's really good grass. Smells really good. The cows will really like it. What we need now is a trombone. Didn't think of that until right now. Call them in, am I right? I'm gonna try something. I did not bring my trombone. I don't own a trombone. I did not bring a trombone. 
out here to help round up the cows. But I do have the YouTube app and uh, Farmer Derek. So I'm gonna see if I can play this. Full volume, Farmer Derek. Playing for the cows to see if they come in. I probably need a bigger speaker. try i think they uh, prefer the real thing not the youtube video or some more noise they're going that way but come here cows here you want some grass actually secret weapon what are the chances that Ooh, secret corn Would you like, I got, it's right, I, any, anyone, anyone? Corn? Let's see what we have here. We still do have some corn out here and a little bit of grass, but it's chewed down a little bit, but there would be enough for them for a while, as long as the, we didn't get any snow or weather you're missing the grass is right here what are you doing all right i'll start i'll head that direction this is awesome this is incredible since they have already crossed that fence once they know what to do and they really don't need me um cows are pretty intelligent uh if they've done it once before they know what to do so they should head home they all know where home is and um, looks like they're pretty much doing it automatically and running. So I might get rid of this tractor and bale of grass and go get my four-wheeler to help scoot them from behind. And we put the grass bale back for another day. unload fencing supplies. So when I'm bahawing around in this machine, I don't lose them. So just make sure you own both sides of the fence. Oh man, this smell, this stuff smells excellent. Uh, this is cereal rye grass that we planted, I don't know, a couple months ago. And uh, we've had some good growth and the cattle just love it. So I don't blame them for stopping and taking a quick bite. But yes, those bulls have to fight. 
bulls will be bulls. You like my coffee? <laughs> you it's did. You spilled, really it did. It's in the cup holder, so I gotta hold it. Tell me you're doing this one-handed. Pros only. All right, what am I doing here? I better help uh, round up, get on my machine, but I'm a row crop farmer and I love what this cover crop is doing. Um, when we calve in February, we'll actually have them out here. So this will be a nice place for them to be during the winter months. There's always a few tools that farmers need um, vice grips are one of them I'm gonna put my windshield up here but it will not stay up because these these um, yeah shocks do not hold so I will just do this like wait for it Then it will uh, hold my windshield up, mostly. Maybe I should put it on this side. There we go. I need a new windshield. And here they come, filing in to the lot, just like good cows should. Hello, 64. work the calves until the cows come home. Come 
Oh, get back in and around there. Don't do it. Don't do it. Come on. Sneak on the fence. Come on. Through the fence. Through the fence. Be nice and calm. Nobody's gonna freak out. You're gonna walk. Nice and easy to bring it back around. I think this is everybody. Slow, slow and low. That is the tempo. Yeah. Hey, Laura! Can you open up that gate down there? Is that is that all of them? Oh yeah, on the outside. Okay, we'll get them. I'm gonna go ahead and feed the cows just a little bit, so they can have a snack for an hour or two and uh, be full before they hit those corn stalks and uh, cover crop. So. What I'm gonna do is put in about a thousand pounds of corn screenings and soybean screenings. And we have a scale on the outside so you can read it from the tracker cab. And then we also have a scale on the inside of the feed truck. Ah, we got all the calves sorted. Looks really good, pretty happy about that. Ooh, a thousand pounds. Does that include my weight? I better step off the truck. No, it did not. And then you dump in a couple thousand pounds of corn silage. This is silage we chopped back, when was that, August? Really pretty good stuff. Mm. Probably, I don't know if it's suitable for human consumption, but I wouldn't eat it. Cows do a much better job of converting those calories to food. We sorted the cows off, and now we will bring the calves into this separate pen. Nice and easy, guys. Nice and easy, relax. Calm, calm, stay calm. Nice job, fellas, looking good, looking good. Thank <laughs> you. 
and do things the hard way. Come back over here. You're gonna be trapped. You're gonna get hurt. Just bullheaded. I guess. That's it? Yeah, they know what to do. Ranger! 